Welcome to a free tutorial brought to you by WordLearningZone.com. I am your instructor, Richard Rost. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to cut, copy, and paste text in Microsoft Word. Here we are inside of Microsoft Word. And take a look up on your toolbar right here. There's three buttons to get familiar with. There's cut, copy, and paste. Now to cut something is to remove it from one location and then paste it in another location. Kind of like when you were a little kid and your mom gave you a pair of scissors and a newspaper and said to cut out that coupon and then paste it over here. Well, you take your scissors, you cut something out and then you paste it in a different location. For example, let's say I want to take the word tutorial out of here and paste it at the end of the sentence. I'll take my mouse and I'll click and drag to select tutorial. I'll click cut that removes it from there. Then I'll click right here in front of the period and hit space to put a space in there and hit paste. That's how you cut and paste something. It removes it from one location and puts it in another spot. I'll hit undo a couple of times to go back to where we were and that's cut and paste. You can also use the keyboard to cut and paste. I'll double click on tutorial to select it. That's a little shortcut there. You can double click on a word to select that word. I'll hit control X on the keyboard. That's hold down the control key and then press X. That'll cut it out. And then I'll click over here at the end and hit control V. That's to paste it. Control X and control V. That's cut and paste. Again, I'll undo a couple times, go back where we were. Now that's cut and paste. How does copy and paste work? Well, copy and paste says to make a copy of something and paste it in that new location. So with the word, let's say, uh, free selected, I'll hit copy. Now nothing appears to happen, but what happened was is Word took that word free and it copied it up to a place called the clipboard the clipboard's little magical happy place in the computer's memory somewhere where it stores information for you. So I hit copy and then I can click somewhere else and hit paste. Now the beautiful thing is I can keep hitting paste, 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 paste to make multiple copies of something. Once something is copied up into your clipboard it stays there until it's replaced by something else. You could think of copy and paste like when you're a little kid and mom gave you silly putty. You can put the Silly Putty over the newspaper and it makes an image on the Silly Putty that you can then paste onto blank white paper. That's copy and paste. And copy is also the keyboard shortcut control C. And if you look, they're right next to each other on the keyboard. X is cut, C is copy, and V is paste. So there are the basics of cut, copy, and paste in Microsoft Word. Now there's a lot more to cut, copy, and paste than what I covered in this short tutorial. I cover cut, copy, and paste and a lot of other topics in my Word 101 tutorial that you can get on my website. And of course you can find out more information at wordlearningzone.com. Now if you're interested in purchasing any of my Word tutorials, go to this special webpage, wordlearningzone.com slash YouTube and get a 25% discount on any courses that you order.